incredible there's a woman running for president. I mean, women really have come a long way. But uh, just when you think we've come so far, something like this happens. There's a car company that just unveiled a new car made only for women. <laughs> Finally, we can stop driving those nasty man cars. <laughs> it's called Seat Me. It's real, and this is it right here. I already know it's for women because it's purple, and that's one of the two colors <laughs> that we have. I didn't know that we needed a woman car, but apparently we do. They say it has jewel effect rims, a handbag hook, <laughs> eyeliner headlights that are emphasized in the same way makeup emphasizes the eye. That's what they say. I prefer to emphasize my headlights the old-fashioned way with push-up bras. They say it's uh, very uh, comfortable. The seats recline all the way back to the 1950s. So... <laughs> to design the car, and I can't believe that whole time no one said, this is a bad idea. <laughs> they teamed up with Cosmo Magazine to design the car. Why? Who knows? But that means the instruction manual is 30 ways to drive your man wild. <laughs> and they say it's going to be available for around $11,000 in uh, early 2017. It's a good price point because women make a fraction of what men make, so that's actually very really good. Yeah! is ridiculous. I mean, how are they expecting women to go out and buy these cars when they know the husband handles all the money? We don't know. <laughs> Honey, how much is $11,000? I don't know. But it really is silly to have a woman car. I mean, women have more to think about than makeup and handbags. We're busy running companies and raising families and trying to become the next president of the United States. <laughs> that car though. <laughs> now let's shift into high gear with a dance.